This work is very much about uh, uh, being, you know, like disarmed somehow or under another person's power, another culture's power. And you just try to find your traces in order to make the whole image out of it. The title of the work is Pre-Image Blind as a Mother Tongue. Pre-Image is a moment where you start to act before you see. The moment where you go exceed image or you act before image happens. Last time I saw my mother before my farewell, I said, Mom, I'm leaving for good. Maybe I'll not see you again. The work is about the absence of this ish, this centered eye, which the West is claiming that they have and we don't. And I'm just trying to trace these different ways, uh, these kind of routes where migrants are taking since decades from this region to go to Europe. I walked this path already, centuries ago maybe. I always remember, even though I can't see any traces. The video starts from Ivros, from Turkey, the river between Turkey and Greece, walking through villages and cities till Rome. The idea of finishing it also in Rome was so important to finish it in that uh, stadium, which is built by the Italian fascism. And this beautiful statue where you see at the end, and it's, it's a kind of cemetery for Europe itself, where it's overdosed in its own beauty, where it's overdosed in speed and uh, the speed which is go faster than its own memory. This uh, image and device is more the vertical Western eye and choosing this also is a very Western technology which you use because a very vertical way, seeing it from above. Walking is very much horizontal attempt and with walking you break this verticality into a few more other instants which make one constant. The way is stretching when you are walking. Or like when you are playing a melody. Also, those mirrors somehow reflects me, reflects my environment, because uh, the mirror is used in a pragmatic way in order to navigate. Uh, but at the same time, uh, being a shaky center, you are not centered. To remember, sometimes you need different archaeological tools. Tools with which you can dig upwards to see your fragmented, scattered parts. Choosing the mirror, which was like we are mirroring each other, but also someone who doesn't have this center. So he starts to find his own location, his own traces, his own parts. But I'm talking about a person who's like around thousands of years old, not only me. Walking always inspires you to, to new things which you didn't take into account. Walking as a Kurdish person also for me is important because Kurdishness is more about longing, not belonging. It's not a message, but in this work, you understand that it's never about we going there as refugees, but it's also we've been forced to leave our places to go there.